Good morning everybody and welcome to another episode of Let's Talk About Cigars. Today I'm going to visit a cigar store in Germany. It's currently 9 in the morning, uh, it's about an hour drive and the cigar store is located in the city called Gornau. It is a very small city just across the border of Holland. Uh, I'm going there with a couple of friends, never been there before. Some people told me it's a great place to have a cigar and have a drink. So. Let's go and do that. The place where I'm going is called Whiskey and Cigar Salon. Never been there, so um, let's see how it goes and uh, I will see you right there. We have finally arrived. This is the place. As you can see, very nice at the water edge. Big terrace outside. Very nice, but it's raining, so uh, let's go in. So this is where you enter the store. Holy shit! Look at all those whiskies. So this is the first part of the store where they have all the whiskies and apparently beers and I see rums in the back. So this is where you enter and you sort of enter into the store, really the shop. So the register over here. Most of you just want to see this. All of the famous brands of the special editions also. Damn. So if you love whiskey, this is definitely a place to visit. 21 years, 25 years. Nice. You already see a part of the humidor here. Some of the accessories. See a lot of Saigar. I do have to say, a lot of accessories I haven't seen before, so that's very nice. Okay, so this is the store. Now let's go to the... Oh, even more accessories. Let's take a look in the humidor and pick, up, pick out a cigar and... Um, let's see how the lounge is. Oh, there is even a lounge up there, as you can see. So, here we are in the humidor. It's very big, very nice walk-in humidor. Immediately you have the non-Cubans over here. Oh wait, let's start with a, a wall of lockers. And then you have the non-Cubans here, some great lighting on it, lighting on it. Some Boveda, Saiga packs. Oh, I hope you can still hear me, but uh, it's going to make a little bit of noise. A lot of the non-Cuban brands, all the big brands are here. I think for a non-Cuban smoker, this is a very good place to be. Very nice with a small island in the middle. It's official Habanos point. But you know me, guys. I'm going for the Cubans. Unfortunately, uh, they don't have anything very special or very old. So if you are really looking for a diamond, this is, I, I don't think you will find it here. They do have some, the regulars, some very good cigars. So enough choice for everybody. I think I'm starting with this. The Vigia Trinidad. So let's start with this, and I think my next one will be the Big Bolivar. Really love that cigar. But it's already in the morning, so we're starting with the Vigia. 
So let's now show you the lounge. So like I just showed you, oh, yeah, it's the go. Trinidad, yeah, the yeah, Figia, yeah, of course with the pigtail, so let's uh, see if the pigtail works. So here we have the first lounge, the downstairs lounge. Uh, the coffee. And here you have one big whiskey collection. We do a lot of whiskey tastings here. Also, you can just pick a whiskey and drink it. Here you have the lounge. And upstairs we have the second lounge. Here we also have a table for the, the, the people that come here regularly. So you can get your name on the table. Like this. So let's check out the, let's, let's check out the upstairs lounge. And we have a nice uh, overview. You can come here with the car and almost park in front of the door. I really like that. No parking cost. So as you can see, one big table. So if you come in with a lot of friends or stuff like that, you can uh, sit here all together. So this is a very, yeah, the, the more simple lounge if you compare with downstairs. Downstairs are great seats. This is just a little bit simpler, but still good because you have a nice view of the store. As you can see here, you don't see this often in cigar stores. You can check it out like this. So, let's talk a little bit more about the cigar store. Because like always, I, I show you the cigar store like I just did. But I also want to talk to you a little about uh, what I think of it. What is my experience thus far. The cigar is not even halfway, but I'm really enjoying it. Um, I really like it. It is in a very small uh, town, just across the border of Holland. Uh, so for the for the Dutch uh, viewers that may want to come here, it's like maybe 10 minutes away from Enschede. Uh, I live in Apeldoorn, that is a little bit to the east side of Holland, and it's just an hour drive. So uh, it, for me, it's very close by. Uh, it is a very nice store, very nice owner, he is a Dutch guy, so when you come here you can speak Dutch, you can speak German, you can speak English with him, so uh, that's a big big plus point. The, the whiskey collection that they have here, excellent. I haven't seen that a lot in, uh, in cigar stores, I know uh, Dusseldorf Cigar World also used to have a big uh, collection of whiskies, I think they have it right now, uh, they, they brought it back. But I really like the concept of you can uh, pick like uh, whatever whiskey you want because I think in that in that in that closet there was like in the cabin is like uh, maybe 30, 40 types of whiskey. So for everybody there is something. I really like that. Also the, the fact that they do a lot of whiskey tastings. Uh, I believe every Friday, Saturday, something like that. So that's a lot. And I think that's, that's very good. The, the, a lot of the, the, the cigar smokers like their whiskies. Um, the store is a little bit more uh, orientated towards the non-Cuban side. I also see a very big Alec Bradley, if I'm not mistaken. I think Alec Bradley sign uh, here in the lounge. So for the Cuban smoker, not too many special things. There's also a very nice big terrace just beside the water. I think I showed you that in the, in the first clip. Very nice. Unfortunately, it's raining today, so we can't sit there. But as a cigar lover, there's nothing better personally to sit outside and enjoy a cigar. So the fact that they have that is a very, very big plus point. Also, um, I showed you now two lounges, downstairs and upstairs. I'm currently sitting in the upstairs lounge. And the owner told me there is a third lounge coming up. So. Very, very impressive. I give it a thumbs up, a big thumbs up, absolutely. 
also the coffee was good. So that was my review about this store. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to like and uh, push here to subscribe. I'm going downstairs to enjoy the rest of my cigar and pick another one. Uh, leave in the comments if you want me to visit another store around this area and I will hopefully do it. Hope you enjoyed it and uh, smoke on.